Hello everybody, it's Dark Strider, and yes, you are reading that correctly. The developers of God of War 2018 have actually snuck in the Infinity Gauntlet. And it's actually like a really good reference. It's something that you really don't see uh, unless you like really look into it. So here's the breakdown. Here's what's going on, okay? You're going to perform one of the side missions or the favors for one of the dwarves. It's called Family Business. Now, in that mission, you actually go and you fight a traveler and the traveler will drop this weapon, the Shattered Gauntlet of Ages, okay? And as you can see, an ancient relic of hell deemed too powerful to remain whole, fragments of its former strength lie scattered throughout the realms. Clear shout out to the Infinity Gauntlet, which that's what this is. Now, they also have the Infinity Stones, okay? And each one is gonna be actually hidden all around the realms uh before you can do anything really when you get this you can load it up with one enchantment okay in order to increase the ability to use three slots like you see i have you're going to need uh dragon tears and dust of realms now dust of realms is easy to get you're going to get it whenever you battle any of those uh tears uh, once you defeat the, the creatures from the tears, you go near the tear, you hit circle again, and you're going to pull out some dust of the realms. Okay, plus other prizes as well. Now, dragon tears, those are going to be a little hard to come by. You're going to find one when you do the uh, inside the mountain quest. Okay, you're going to get one for each of the dragons that you're able to free. So there's three more right there. And then the last one you're going to get is uh, Baldur's Dragon, when it dies, you can go to the top of the Forgotten Caverns and you'll find it right underneath the uh, dragon's mouth. So you're gonna need all five of those plus a lot of hex silver, like butt loads of hex silver. So do whatever you can to get hex silver, uh, you know, like sail around and knock into like the uh, barrels so that that way it drops it. Do uh, any of the treasure maps. You know, whatever you have to do, uh, you know, have Atreus work in a coal mine or something for a couple of hours or something like that. Well, I mean, actually don't do that because I don't know if there's like a Norse god of CPS, but get as much hex silver as you can. All right. The other thing is once you get it, you're going to have to get all of the stones. Now there's different stones. As you can see, I have the Asgard shard of existence loaded in which is supposed to be the reality stone all right uh let's see ivaldi's corrupted mine that's the mind stone and and vari's soul that's the soul stone okay there's also eye of the outer realm which is the space stone and that's actually a little bit hard at this moment i'm trying to uh see if i could get back to the area where that stone is found it's at the end of the escape from helheim mission and I'm having a problem getting back into the Odin's chamber, which is at the end. So if you know a way to do it, if you know uh, how to get back into that chamber, drop it in the comments below so that we can figure this out together, okay? On top of that, there's also uh, Muselheim's Eye of Power, which actually okay, you can just good. buy from the dwarves over here. So let's see, I'll show you right where it is. I believe it's enchantments here. Yep, there it is. Musafim's Eye of Power, that's the uh, Power Stone. Okay, uh, Eye of the Outer Realm is supposed to be the Space Stone, the one that I'm missing. And then the very last stone we'll have is Nord's Temporal Stone, which is the Time Stone. And in order to get that, you have to defeat the Valkyrie Queen. All right? Uh, you know, once again, like hey, I said, it's a here. lot of stuff that you have to put together uh, as far as... Uh, getting all of the uh, stones and like I say lots of hex silver in order to upgrade the gauntlet and when you actually get it all you have to do is hold the L1 button and hit the circle and it does crazy things like that now those bolts you saw they'll come right back and hit whatever creature you're trying to actually attack on top of that 
if you mix and match all of the other stones, they all do different things, okay? So they're, as long as they're loaded into the gauntlet, they're going to do all kinds of different weird things, and it, it's just, like, incredible. So you definitely want to get this. It's actually a really cool uh, Easter egg, and it's just awesome to actually have something like this that was snuck in, especially with, you know, Infinity War out with, you know, the Avengers and Thor out there. It's actually pretty cool. So, uh, you know, just to let you know that this was out there. Like I said, if you know of any way to get to the Eye of the Outer Realm, which is at the end of the Escape from Helheim mission, it's a uh, Odin's secret chamber. And I just, I can't get back to it. I just don't know how to do it. I've been for hours trying to do it but you know let's help out the community some people may have missed it uh some people don't want to wait for like a new game plus and some people really don't want to just start the game over in order to get that it also opens up a lot of questions like you know how are you supposed to complete 100 percent when you can't even get to that one spot so anyway i hope you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe it helps the channel out a lot I try to upload as often as I can, especially when I find some news like this. Uh, you know, I'm going to try to get a more detailed uh, video out, which is going to show how to get all the materials in order to upgrade the gauntlet, as well as how to find it and how to find the stones. So that that way, everybody is on board and everybody knows what's going on. All right. So. Please drop in the comments below. What do you think of this Easter egg? Do you think that this is cool? Is this something you want to try out? Do you think that it's just like really wild that they snuck this in? Do you think that it's reaching? A lot of people do see that this is the Infinity Gauntlet. Anyway, like I said, you know, if you know any way to get into that one area, you know, let's help the community out. It's actually pretty awesome. As always, thanks for watching.